Sandeep? Yeah, hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Can we start now? Yes, you can. Tell me about yourself. Yeah, I am Sanjay. I am from Bhopal and I have completed my graduation from Ajit University, Bhopal. And then after I joined a Virla Soft and I am doing work as a software engineer and I have a two year experience and uh, I have a good knowledge in a Spring, a Spring Boot microservices and I have worked on like financial project. Uh, that's, all, that's all about me. <clears throat> okay. Can we please explain microservices? Uh, microservices, <laughs> basically, uh, microservices is like, uh, uh, it's a, one of the architectures. So in microservices, uh, we have to break our project in the multiple modules. And uh, those modules we have to make as a one on microservices. And uh, those microservices we have to deploy in the independently, independently developer will do the work on that. And then after we can... Uh, use it. So we can communicate one microservices to another microservices and uh, those are the architecture we can say basically. And uh, while accessing a user to the microservices architectures, we are providing a one API gateway in that uh, they will do the validations and authentication. And then after based on the request, we can call those particular microservices and we can done all those operations related to the customers. Yeah, that's all. What is circuit uh, breaker? Circuit breaker is also we are using while using a microservice architecture. So circuit breaker is basically, uh, for example, we are like uh, traffic is coming from the customers and we have to switch from one traffic to another traffic or uh, we have to provide uh, like load balances like that. So we can use that time as circuit breakers. What is the purpose of collection concept in Java? <laughs> collection is basically a framework in Java. So whenever we want, uh, like uh, in uh, like uh, whatever the data structures we have, so data structures we are uh, using as a collections and uh, whatever the link list, array, array list we are using it. <laughs> and collection provides the like. Uh, different different way to store the data and we can utilize to maintain our data with efficiency and easily we can move our data we can do all those operations with the help of the collection framework that's okay can you tell me about your current project uh, my current project is uh, financial related so we are doing work on the one finance like uh, if people uh, going to the hospitals and they don't have a amount to pay so they will take uh, some uh, loan like that and they will do the finance for that and uh, once they will do the finance uh, we can uh, provide them like what is the monthly they have to take for the 12 month or 36 month or 24 month based on that finance year we can uh, provide a monthly what is the EMI they have to pay and uh, they will proceed with the EMI. So based on the like whatever the citizens and uh, they have a Aadhaar card or Gotra ID card based on that we have checked the locations and uh, based on that uh, <laughs> we are providing a loan to that people so they will uh, pay the bill to the particular special and they will do our treatment. So this is the financial product uh, we have providing to the in our project and we have uh, using the technology like uh, react uh, spring uh, springboard microservice architectures and uh, we have uh, some services called uh, net css token component ihs so different different type of the modules we have and based on that we are creating them providing the like financial freedom to the customers Okay. What what is the stock production in my SQL? A store procedure like uh, uh, in the one operations we are trying to store some data in the multiple tables. So we can go with the store procedure because uh, <laughs> if you go with the normal query, we can store 
data in only one table and maybe we have to write the lots of the big query to store multiple tables so we can go with the procedure or function and based on that we can store data quickly in the database and those function we can reuse like uh, reuse it uh, multiple places so that is the benefits of the store procedure and the store procedure we can create in our uh, with the help of the plsql language we can create in our database and we can use it with the help of the repository and we can utilize it okay what is the difference between hash map and link hash map in java hash map uh, <laughs> As map like uh, we can store the data as a key value pair and they will take uh, one key as a null and multiple value as a null and we can store key as a unique key so it will not store the duplicate value in value we can make a duplicate no so and uh, <coughs> if you talk about the link has map so link map has map will store the data in the same way but internally they have a connection between one uh, node to another node and uh, they will proceed with that and so that uh, in the link uh, hash map uh, based on the insertion order your data will be stored but uh, in the hash map there is no order it's a default order they will prefer to insert the data and it will do the internal sorting also based on the key do you know about the java 8 feature yeah in Java and features, they have come up with the multiple APIs and with the help of the API, they have tried to make uh, our code more efficient. So I know about like what is the stream API, Lambda expressions, function interface. With the help of that, uh, we can do the operations and um, we can make our code more efficient and more faster. And we can do some bulk amount of the operation at the same times very easily and very less code we have to write if you go with the lambda expressions you don't want to provide any implementation for the function interface so that is the one more benefit we have with the help of the lambda expression to implement directly any function interface and uh, after that if you go with the stream api so they will provide lots of the method to proceed with our array or whatever the list of the data we have and we can filter it <coughs> In streams, we have some map or uh, field, uh, flat map. And then after we have uh, something called uh, filters and sort, reduce, everything we can do the operations. Okay. Okay, I have done from my side. Do you have any question? No, I don't have. 